Vice President Kamala Harris poised to pick Minnesota Governor Tim Walz as her running mate. The anticipated pick made quickly in the two weeks since Biden dropped out, now thrusting the popular Midwestern governor into the national spotlight, seen as an attempt to appeal to voters in key Rust Belt swing states like Michigan and Wisconsin. Walls, a longtime champion of working class issues, expected to bring a down-to-earth approach to the campaign's attacks on former President Donald Trump, dubbing him and running mate J.D. Vance as weird in a recent TV appearance. You do not need your elected officials to give you a sermon, but they should try and live one. And these guys are weird on how they frame it. Harris picking the governor over several other VP hopefuls. The new Democratic presidential ticket will spend the next several days crisscrossing the country, starting with Pennsylvania to Michigan to Wisconsin to North Carolina. Scheduled to follow up at each of those stops, Republican vice presidential nominee Senator J.D. Vance holding events in rebuttal. Privately, the Trump-Vance campaign has revealed Harris is a tougher opponent than President Joe Biden. Publicly, they've insisted the strategy has not changed. Trump, who has repeatedly attacked Biden's intelligence, is shifting the same rhetoric to Harris and her running mate, whoever she chooses. I think virtually every one of them is considered better, smarter, uh, would be a better president than her. But we can't allow her to be president. She's going to destroy our country. A source tells ABC News more than 10,000 people are expected to attend tonight's Pennsylvania rally for Harris and her new running mate. That would make this Harris's biggest campaign event yet. Christiane Cordero, ABC News, Washington.